Jurassic Park, originally a book by Michael Crichton, tells the tale of a billionaire philanthropist and a small team of genetic scientists who've created a wildlife park of cloned dinosaurs. The dinosaurs find a way to escape their enclosures and proceed to terrorize park goers. But what if Jurassic Park wasn't just a story? What if Jurassic Park was real? Hello and welcome back to Life's Biggest Questions. I'm Charlotte Dobre. If this is your first time here, don't forget to hit that thumbs up and let us know in the comments below what topics you would like to see next. We've all wondered if there would ever be a way to to use modern science to clone dinosaurs, but creating a real life Jurassic Park definitely wouldn't be achieved in the same way that it was in the film, by using dinosaur DNA from a fossilized mosquito preserved in amber. It is impossible to use million year old dinosaur DNA because it simply doesn't exist, at least not anymore. Hybrid dinosaurs might be a possibility though, as in a cross between a dinosaur and something else. Chickens and other birds carry dinosaur DNA, and it can theoretically be altered to create a dinosaur. Scientists have already created dinosaur legs, dinosaur feet, and dinosaur beaks with teeth. None of these creatures hatched, but with a little more tweaking, they could. According to renowned paleontologist Jack Horner, at the very least, the creation of a miniature dinosaur might be a reality in around 10 years. Jack Horner was a technical advisor for all of the Jurassic Park films, and also inspired the character Dr. Alan Grant. So now that you know that it's possible to create a dinosaur hybrid, it could also be possible for Jurassic Park to be real. According to Horner, there are several ways in which a real Jurassic Park would be different from the film. For the purpose of the film, Steven Spielberg made his velociraptors quite, well, vicious. In real life, no animal hunts for sport, not even dinosaurs. So if you happen to find yourself face to face with a velociraptor, they definitely wouldn't tear open your car to get to you. A real life Jurassic Park might resemble a wildlife reserve, where you could go on a safari and observe dinosaurs in their habitat. I would also like to point out that the dinosaurs in the film are likely a lot different from what dinosaurs actually looked like millions of years ago. Real life dinosaurs could have been any color you can think of, because dinosaurs are related to both reptiles and birds. That includes bright green, blue, red, and even pink. Despite objection from Horner, Steven Spielberg purposefully made the dinosaurs in Jurassic Park muted shades of dark green and brown, because it made them much scarier. I mean, I guess that makes sense. If a bright pink T-Rex was running after me, I definitely wouldn't be as scared as I was in that scene from Jurassic Park. And according to the discovery of new fossils, many dinosaurs had feathers, especially velociraptors and T-Rex. But bringing dinosaurs back poses a big problem. Because dinosaurs went extinct millions of years ago, they would become an invasive species, and they would compete with native current species for resources. There aren't a lot of animals right now that could become predators and take on a dinosaur, so because of this, dinosaurs would reproduce rapidly. They would hunt current species of animals and likely cause many to go extinct. Dinosaurs would be no match for humans though. If it ever got to the point where the dinosaurs we have brought back to life begin to get out of control and cause problems for us, we could simply eliminate them. Perhaps it wouldn't be the best idea to create a real Jurassic Park. Running a dinosaur park would not be cheap either. It would cost something like $23 billion, according to Business Insider. If a park was that expensive to run, that would mean a ticket to the park would be around $7,500 US. So even if there was a real life dinosaur park, the vast majority of people wouldn't get to experience it. Would you want to experience a real life Jurassic Park? Let us know in the comments below. We've come to the end of our video. Thanks so much for watching the whole thing. If you love this video, you'll definitely love What If Michael Myers Was Real? Or What If Jigsaw Was Real? Thank you so much for watching Life's Biggest Questions.